I don't think I can sit on the ground. My old body ain't gonna make it. My old body. My body. Okay. Hello, guys. Ugh. I'm Shane. Welcome to my channel. I just got home from work. It was sort of kind of crazy, a bad day. I don't want to think about it. I don't want to talk about it. Moving forward. <laughs> uh, I did work at like four this morning. I was supposed to be done at noon. I had four days this week of work and they tricked me and asked me to go help out at another other clinic that needed help. I didn't get done until like five something. And then traffic is always bad. And I'm just upset because Monday I had to work at like 4.30 in the morning and I didn't get done until like 8, between 8 and 8.30. It was a long day. I'm just tired of these long days. I'm getting burnt out. Also, my skin is super broke out. My face, I have tons of pimples around my mouth a lot. I don't know really why. Aside from me, I do know why. I got that new proactive, um, the one meant for your body, the body scrub, the salicylic acid one. That makes you break out. If you see a white mark on my neck, that is also salicylic acid because I have an ingrown hair. Okay. I don't want to waste a lot of time with video and intro and yet that stuff. I got a few things in the mail I was going to open. I'm curious because I don't know really for sure what it is. I think I got Amazon Prime. I had it in the past when I was in Carolina by mistake. I, I bought it. But then I got it more recently because I wanted to watch the Normani. Well, the Rihanna Fenty and Normani fashion show. But yeah, so you see that white thing on my neck? That's because I have an ingrown hair really super painful okay so first I don't know who watches my YouTube or who follows me on other social media I met a couple really cool kids the other day uh, like they're my new friends here in Florida I ate a crap ton of food today at work I was uh, upset depressed I was just eating my feelings yada yada we know how that is so I got a couple of stuff from forever 21 because I hung out with my new friends and we went to this mall in Florida called Sawgrass Mall. And it's like the second largest shopping center so that they said of the area or in Florida where the largest shopping center is Mall of America. I don't know if this is true or not. I'm just going off what they told me. <laughs> so they were shopping at all the Gucci name brand stores that I can't afford. Gucci, Prada, Neiman Marcus, whatever, Versace, yada yada. I did not get really anything at all except for well the first thing I seen were these shoes okay and you might think Shane you have a billion million trillion shoes on your channel before you could see my boots are on the couch what are these what's so important about these shoes if anyone knows me I just hit myself in the mouth oh and I got bleach in my eye at work right when I was leaving green is my favorite color not a dark green like this, but like a, um, a neon green. This is an olive green. However, whether you can see this or not, it looks almost like snake skin. The big reason that I got this though, this is from Forever 21. The name is Shane, spelled the same way as my name. Okay, y'all, get into it. It was fate, it was God telling me to get these. Um, I hung out with Pierre and Nick and Carlos. We went to the mall, we went to Cheesecake Factory, we went to all these like bougie name brand stores where they're just trying on heels and pumps and acting a mess, kiki, -ki, ka, ka kai kai. And I'm like, you know, older and nervous and I don't got the money to be blowing on, you know, Michael Kors and just everything, Barneys and Saks and everywhere that we went. So these from Forever 21. I was like, they're my name, I have to get them. God is telling me, he's calling me, right? Calling me back home. And uh, then they have in my size, that's another rare find. And they had several in my size. Tried them on, I loved them. They fit great, they look great, yada yada, so on and so forth. 
and they don't look like other things I already have. I always like the variety, not to mention my name. So the price tag said that these were $35. When I rang them up at the cashier, the register, they rang up as 16. Not that anyone cares to know, but green is my favorite color, and then 16 is my all-time favorite number, but in reality, I like any number that has six in it. Where some people think that uh, seven is a lucky number. Then I got this. Okay, now yes, I'm in Florida, and yes, this is like a wintertime sweater type of camisole or cardigan, or I don't know whatever frick you call this thing, but I love this. I feel like an old person. I feel cozy and warm. It's like a bathroom. I can see myself drinking coffee or tea in the snow. So there you have that. I love this. And um, it's like that weird material look. It looks like a tweed. I have sweatpants from Express that would go great with that. I got this headband from Forever 21. It's an elastic, a stretchy. It was like five bucks. And I got these really cute hoop earrings. They're super like lightweight. They're cheap plastic. This is Forever 21, y'all. One of my favorite times that I um, did makeup or wore makeup out is a pink smoky eye. Like I just love it. I live for it. That would give me all the feels. So I got an Amazon Prime box right here. Amazon. I got a Fashion Nova package right here. I'm guessing it's Halloween costumes. And then I got a package from my dad. I'm trying to just get into this. And here we go to Proactive. That's what I need anyway. So Proactive Skin Exfoliating, exfoliating um, Face Scrub. That's what I really needed. The thing that I bought is actually meant for body, and it's salicylic acid, not so good. Then this is Daiche La Brasiliana, really good hair stuff. It has collagen and keratin. I love this stuff, I love the smell, I just love, love, love. Getting to Fashion Nova, okay? These are Halloween costumes, I hope. If not, then what the heck? Come on, girl. I feel Okay, so they're not the Halloween costumes. I did order the Pretty Woman Halloween costume, and that is not this. However, I ordered this red, sexy, like almost devil costume. It's telling me keep this away from a kid that could suffocate or something or other. Y'all, I might be the red devil for Halloween. I might be a dominatrix of a, of a seductress. So this is my, my Fashion Nova strappy, sexy, latex. Oh my, my. Oops, I did it again. Hit me baby one more time. I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to fit into this. And I got the cutouts for my side fat. We're gonna live for that. We're gonna try that on later after I actually shower because I'm gross from work. And then this was something that um, is a white suit that I've seen Adrian Bailon wear on the reel and I really liked it. And it was called something about, you know, keeping it professional or mixing business with pleasure or whatever, whatever. So this is something where it has one boob and one sleeve, okay? And it's meant to be like a one sleeve. And then it has a belt, and we're gonna get into that later. And I got size large, and we're gonna see how this goes. Yeah. It's very interesting, very interesting. I hope I fit this stuff, because it sucks when you buy something and then you don't fit into it. Because not only does it hurt your feelings, because you can't wear it, and it's almost like fat shaming. <laughs> there goes your pride. Fashion Nova, you want some percentage off, text Nova to somewhere. Okay, and last but not least, my dad said he had to send me mail. I'm most interested to get my engagement ring back. Yay, for me. 
have my ring getting repaired. Here's my ring. And what the heck is this? I got a folding backpack from Macy's. Interesting. Cool. I don't know why he gave me that. Um, somebody, Dylan Shane. That's all junk mail. I hate getting mail. I don't know if any of you do. It's like always stupid or bills. It's never anything that you want. My dad always opens my mail. That's hilarious. Oh my god, Department of Hawaii is taxing me. Okay. Um, yeah. So, this is my engagement ring, y'all. And there it goes. Kaput. Okay. Wait a second. I don't have a word on this hand. I'm looking at it. There was a crack in the bottom of my ring. Um, it's from Ashcroft and Oak. Okay, it come in a little box looking like that. It looks like a completely different ring, and I haven't seen it in a while, but I think that they soldered it, and they maybe did some other stuff to it. Ugh. I put it on the ring finger, and not. I put it on the wrong finger, and now I know I won't be able to get it off. Well, it's going to stay on there until I wash my hand. It's kind of looking crazy, so I want to go wash it now. I'm excited. This was like a $2,000 ring. Okay, guys. Hope you enjoy my little stupid video. Leave me comments. Um, if you want to see me try on the Fashion Nova stuff. If you want to see me parade around in these. Ow! I hit myself. I bought these and Avery loved them. I send her pictures and she's like, are you going to wear them? I'm like, bitch, yes, I'm fucking wearing them to work. I don't get bleach on them or blood. I'm kidding. I am going to wear them though. I tried to do this video because like I thought the light was going to be good because I only have so much sunlight. See, and I should have put the camera over there because I look really hideous and ugly in like plain light. <laughs> Come on, white boy. Mm, my skin and everything is disgusting. See all my breakouts? I got pimple here, and then there, and then two and three, and then five, six, seven, eight, and ten. And I got a hundred million more. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go wash my hand with like Dawn dish soap. That usually gets a nice little glisten and sparkle on the ring. And then I hope you guys like my video. Get into it. Of course I could wear this on Halloween, but that's like the obvious, like, I want to see your peacock, cock, 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 your peacock, cock, cock. Bye, guys.